What's up, Storm Watchers? I hope you guys all had a, a good couple of weeks. I didn't get to post last week because the hotel I stayed in didn't have free Wi-Fi, so I didn't get to post. But um, I did. Le we left Wednesday last Wednesday, so I did get to go to Atlanta. We left Wednesday morning, and then we stopped in New Orleans that night, and then we went the rest of the way to Atlanta. Super crazy. Oh, crazy ghetto town, that's for sure. There's like a, a small portion of it that isn't, but yeah, just not exactly what we were expecting. We did get to walk along Bourbon Street in New Orleans the night before, and that it was more of what I was expecting because I knew that New Orleans was a crazy town, but I had no idea how bad Atlanta was. Yeah, Gavin got to compete. He got second in tower. One meter he got fifth. And then in three meter he got third. Which is the one he got last year. Is he got first. And one guy actually got injured. Um, he, he smacked his arm on the board. But he was okay. He just His hand was a little swollen and beat up. But he was fine because he drank lots of milk. That's right, kids drink lots of milk and you get nice strong bones and nothing will, you know, break as easily as, you know. I'm not saying jump off a building if you drink lots of milk because I'm not going to guarantee nothing will happen. But, so, yeah, that's that. The last weekend was Comic Con in San Diego for those who went or those who knew about it and caught up with it and the DC and Marvel announcements and her overall kind of a disappointment but Marvel announced basically all that they're gonna bring forth in the Avengers everybody in, in the next coming Avengers the whole lineup and then DC released a picture of who will be Wonder Woman in her costume. So, yeah, that was pretty much it. I know, right? You, you were hoping for probably, like, trailer, line up, something, but no, nothing. Yeah, um, trailers that came out last weekend, uh, Into the Woods, which is basically kind of a grim story mashup. I couldn't tell if they were going to make it a musical again, but the one that came out many 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 years ago was a musical but this one has Meryl Streep, Johnny Depp, um, Emily Blunt all those people in it so it'll be a good one to go see it comes out in Christmas so don't get all excited but yeah the trailer is finally out for that one the new Hobbit trailer came out this past weekend I am kind of relieved it came out this weekend instead of in September or October when Peter Jackson kind of was saying it would, but I think that just means the, the more detailed one, the one that gets you all excited because it actually shows you legit footage of the movie. Let's see, Mad Max trailer, they're doing a reboot, oops, they're doing a reboot of Mad Max, the same director, so those of you who are Mad Max fans, don't get all disheartened because it's someone else you're doing. It's the same director, so that'll be cool. I think they said Tom Hardy is in it. So, yeah. Oh, let's see. Another. Oh! Jeez, I'm just dropping brains out. <laughs> uh, it's the wood. Yeah, and the new, the new Catching... Uh, no. Mocking Jay. New mo Mocking Jay trailer with actual footage from the movie came out this past weekend, so when you stop watching, you know, the press footage. I mean, that's cool and all, but it doesn't really give you any movie information besides the rebellion is on, or whatever it is. But yeah, so that's, I think, all the trailers I can think of right now. Um, tomorrow, Guardians of the Galaxy comes out for all y'all fans waiting to go see that. Some of y'all are probably going to go tonight, and some of y'all are probably already lined up. <laughs> but Yes, yeah, so Guardians of the Galaxy and the new James Brown movie, or I say James Brown movie, but Get It On Up or whatever it's called. That 
it's about James Brown. But yeah, so that comes out tomorrow also. And la um, last week's like show box, movie box times, whatever, show that Lucy came in number one. Lucy, if y'all don't know, is the new Scarlett Johansson movie. It's a pretty cool movie from what I've seen. And then Hercules came in second. Hercules, the new The Rock. Hercules, and then third came in was Planet of the Apes, Apes on Horses, yeah, <laughs> and this coming weekend also is Comic-Con in San Antonio for all y'all Comic-Con fans uh, who are going out tomorrow, have fun, be safe, you know, get lots of autographs and pictures, and it should be pretty fun, and Comic-Con, yep, uh, one second, here we go. I dropped my list. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm going crazy right now. Um, yeah, so tomorrow, as most of y'all probably noticed, y'all looked at your calendars, but today is the last day of July. August is fastly approaching, which means, sadly, school. <sighs> yeah. School, darn it, back to school shopping. Shoot, seems like summer just started like yesterday. Darn, I think it's all this traveling I've been doing and a little bit of summer classes is also kind of, you know, seems like my summer break just started. But yeah, I'm registered for fall classes, so I did not procrastinate. It's not even August, but I'm already signed up. That is a good student for you. No, I'm kidding. I'm totally kidding about being a good student. But, yeah, so back to school, which means crazy Walmart shoppers at the last minute, you know, tax free weekend and all that craziness that comes with school starting up again. Probably a lot of very unhappy teenagers that have to start school soon, which means waking up before noon. Yeah, I'm kind of guilty of that, too, staying up really late and then kind of sleeping in. But I haven't been too bad because I've still been waking up around the same time, even though I go to bed really late. Yeah, so August, I think that's all. I guess I just wanted to take up as much time as possible because I didn't get to broadcast last week. Yeah, so with all that information, have a good weekend somehow. I mean, if it's Comic Con, going to the movies, just hang out at home, relaxing when you still have a summer, or if you don't have one, I'm sorry. Just enjoy um, time off after you get done watching this video. But yeah, so uh, have a good weekend. Stay awesome, Storm Watcher.